Hey everyone, welcome back. All right, today's workout, we're gonna start every 90 seconds for six total sets. So it's gonna be nine minutes. We're gonna have 10 front rack reverse lunges. So we're gonna pick our bar up. We're gonna put it in the front rack. Elbows are gonna be nice and high. We're stepping back, tapping the back knees to the ground and standing tall. Okay, my focus is on keeping my chest and elbows up, keeping my back, butt cheek, clutch super tight as I come down to the ground, and I'm making sure that I'm not hinging forward. Okay, so nice and upright, core is braced, nice and tight, elbows are high. All right, and I'm pulling myself back forward through my front heel, okay? So we have 10 of those, 10 total, five each leg, alternating legs. If you don't have a barbell, we can go with a kettlebell, okay? That is part A. For part B, we have a 12 minute AMRAP. We're going to start with 10 kettlebell, one arm front rack squats. So I'm taking my kettlebell, I'm bringing it to the front rack. I want my knuckles to my chin. My kettlebell is being cradled on my arm. It's not behind me, okay? So in front, set my feet in my squat stance. My opposite arm can be out for balance. And I'm doing five, and then I'm switching to the other side for another five, okay? From there, I'm moving to 15 box jumps. Okay, so I have my box, landing, standing tall, either stepping down or hopping back. Okay, however you want to do it is fine, 15. From there, we move to 20 kettlebell rows. So I'm staggered stance, elbow is on my thigh, I'm gripping onto my kettlebell, squeezing my pinky super tight, squeezing my elbow in towards my opposite hip as I pull. Okay, so we're going 10, and then switching sides. I want to pause at the top, make sure we're not just rushing through these, okay? So 12 minute AMRAP, 10 kettlebell front squats, 15 box jumps, 20 rows. For part C, we're going to go barbell curls. Squeezing up, controlling the way down. Elbows are gonna stay in, okay? So nice and controlled. We're doing 10 to 12 reps. If you have weight, you can add weight. We're pairing that with dips. So you're gonna do a chair dip or a box dip. The straighter my legs are, the harder it will be. The higher my legs are, the higher it will be. So if you have something to put your feet on, you can do that. Elbows are moving straight back. We're trying to get to 90 degrees of elbow bend flexion, and then we're pressing straight up, nice and straight. Okay, so we have 10 to 12 of those. We're gonna do three to four sets of that, so depending on how challenging that is for you, you can do an extra set uh, so you can get in some extra work. All right, so that's our workout today. Have a good one.